My parents have raised me in the church. I've been going to church since I was a baby. I've always liked going. There's a couple times that I didn't really like going. I've always been there, but sometimes you just fall back. There's a lot of stuff that's happened. I had my best friend um, try to commit suicide. First time, I didn't tell anyone about it. I um, kind of just sulked to myself, stopped reading the Bible. The second time he tried to commit, yeah, that really hit me hard. I uh, went downhill pretty good. It just confused me. I didn't really know what was going on or how that could happen. I was always very joyful. Everyone's always said that about me. Um, but when that struck, it just kind of like threw me a curveball. It's like one week I'd feel great. I'd feel back to my normal self. And then another week it'd be like, what's going on? I feel like I'm trapped right now. I'd... It kind of just set me far from God. I felt distant from him. Stopped reading the Bible, still going to youth group, but it didn't really feel like youth group. It just felt like a hangout or just something that I had to do. It just kind of made me realize that there needs to be a big change in my life. I knew I needed God in my life to get through it. So I reached to reached out to Jordan because I knew he was close and he was the youth leader. So I knew I could go to him with anything. And so he gave me Bible verses that I read constantly. And every first I would pick the verse apart and um, translate it into my life. It just kind of made me realize that God needed to be in my life and I always needed him there. It was just a feeling I had never felt before. And it was so different and an awesome feeling that I just wanted more and more of it. It set everything apart. I felt like I was in a whole different place. I like going to the pond and sitting on that bench. It's gotta be one of the most important things in my life. I feel like you really need a place that you can go by yourself, you can connect with yourself, and you can connect with God. I've learned for my faith to be a priority, that I need to be consistent in coming to um, our squad or church or serving or reading the Bible. Um, at least one of those things I need on a weekly basis to just stay consistent with God and make sure that He's constantly in my life. God needs to be in my life and I always need Him there. And I never want to lose that.